my mouth is full. Talking is not necessary. Hey everybody, it is me, Kyle, and welcome to the Salt Lake behind me here. It is an amazing place to eat barbecue here in Austin. Let's go in and eat some barbecue. Oh, this is all you can eat, by the way. All you can eat, so we're gonna eat all we can. Uh, don't be fooled by all the empty tables. Trust me, this place is packed. We're just here at an odd hour and an odd day. I think about three years since I've had the Salt Lake, so this bite is going to be very worth the wait. <laughs> More. I opted for the all you can eat because I've been deprived of this for three years, so I'm going to make up for lost time. Lost brisket. Oh, it's so tender. It's a meaty rib. It's not like one of those like bony ribs. You know, it's a, it's a really meaty experience. I want to use my hands, but I have to film. Oh. That is incredible. The the beans add such a great compliment to it. Mm. Here's just a piece of the brisket right here. You know, look at that. Is that even focused? I don't know. I don't even know if this is in focus or not, but nevertheless, it's just uh, this perfectly carved piece of meat. I want to explain something here. There's a difference between like barbecue that has been charred or you know, but the barbecue here, even though it's it's very tender, it doesn't taste like it's burnt or it doesn't taste like it's overcharred. That's one of my biggest complaints about barbecue, is that it's overdone. Like when you eat it, you you taste the the burnt meat or the the charcoal, right? But this this is perfectly well done, smoked, really great stuff. And Khan got the all you can eat for 25 bucks. I got the plate for around $16, and trust me, I don't even think I'm going to finish this. Portions here, massive. Happens all the time at barbecue places, right? We, we think we can eat more. I mean, this guy got an all-you-can-eat, and he barely ate, you know? <laughs> yeah, this that's, is our to-go. <laughs> yeah, that's dinner and breakfast tomorrow as well. Meet up, meet up. I don't know how else to introduce uh, this. Austin, we are here. Austin, hello. Hello, hello, Austin. Hello. <laughs> hello. Oh, familiar face, of course. And, uh, yeah. This is the youngest member. <laughs> yeah, this is, yeah, the youngest fan. All right, well, thank you guys for coming, yeah. Uh, very small, intimate meet, but, you know, nevertheless, that's, exactly what I was looking for. So, by the way guys, if you wanted to know about this meet, you should have been on Facebook or Snapchat. This was not announced on uh, on YouTube, so, you know, I like these small meets where people 
like-minded people get together and I don't have to shout when I talk. So. <laughs> no offense to the Houston meet, but there was a lot of shouting. But thank you everybody for coming. I still can't believe it. It's awesome. Yeah. Thank you again, love. Nice to, nice to meet you. Texas has been amazing. When you're in Austin, Kyle, you gotta throw up the horns, so hook them horns. That's what they do in Austin? That's what they do in Austin. Okay. Hook them horns. <laughs> that felt very weird. <laughs> oh, man, this is fun. This is, uh, I love meeting viewers because it gives a face to a username, a face to a like, a comment. So I'm very appreciative. Physical presence. Physical presence. Thank you guys so much for, for watching and for coming and <sighs> goodbye Austin. All right, let's roll. All right, Austin, we're out. Yeah, I guess we love freezing in Austin. Words are very unnecessary, so I'm just gonna shut up and keep eating.